Hello everyone, since I reached 600 subscribers, this is my tutorial on how to checkmate with a king and two knights against a king and a rook pawn. Just like with any pawn, you want to block the pawn at the upper half of the board. Because the pawn is a rook pawn, your blockading knight's mobility will be greatly limited. Here it's where it gets different compared to a center pawn. You have to first trap the enemy king on your side of the board, then move your blockading knight to a different blockading square to assist in trapping the king. This is possible because with a rook pawn, you can sometimes checkmate with just a king and one knight. We have to chase the king to the queen side so that the second knight can deliver checkmate. Here, if black takes the knight white has a checkmate in 12 moves which will be left as an exercise to the viewer. In this game black decided to move its king to a8. If black doesn't comply you will need to switch directions and chase the king to the a1 corner. We have gotten the king trapped in the a8 corner, but we have to move our blockading knight when the black king is on a dark square so that it can deliver checkmate before the a pawn queens. We must execute the following triangulation, or aka the parallelogrammation. Once the maneuver is executed, the king is now on a dark square and we can allow our blockading knight to join the attack and end the game with a checkmate. If you want to see more chess tutorials like this please like and subscribe and also join my discord with link in the description.